Hello everybody and welcome back to Lucky by Nature. So this is episode 3 of Let's Play. This is the new beginning. So we pretty much got most of our egg layers done. So now what I really need to do is get a dino that will take me through some of the caves. We do have a few Bronto eggs so I think I'm going to look for a saber. And uh, hopefully everything will work out. So let's just see and check it out. Alright, so we're still looking. Or I'm still looking. But I haven't had much uh, luck. I need a pretty decent level saver. But I seem to be finding just low level ones. Uh, even RGs. So we still need an RG. And there's still a lot of alphas. We've already killed probably around 50, 60 alphas. And there's still quite a few, but uh, they're starting to dwindle. So it's not too bad. If I don't get lucky around here, then uh, we'll just have to stop and come back later. Oh, there's one there. Oh, look at that. 145 can't beat that and uh, I know a lot of people look for 150s but I don't know about you guys I have not had very much luck with 150s they they seem to be pretty crap in fact I found a Carno and uh, the thing had like 160 melee I mean it was bad alright so let's get up on here all right, come on, little dude. Man, I don't know, uh, but have you guys noticed how these guys can climb over, like, go up on rocks, no problem. It's kind of crazy now. Whoo! <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't th guess it's coming back. Let's go get it. That's all I need. To run around after these guys but uh, they made them into chickens now oh come on and see when I first start out I I do like to use my pteranodon just because you know I can uh, move quick oh, there we go is that it yep that's my baby right there and they can't get up here, so that's good. Usually they find their way around, but uh, this one's kind of dumb, I guess. So what I do is, um, I already know that they're going to run li like that. So I hit them a few times, uh, you know, pretty rapid fire. And then, uh, you know, it can run a bit. It's all right. And uh, that way it can get some of its health back. But I gotta be very careful as to where I uh, land because if it does get me and it, it slaps me, I'm gonna go flying. I don't want to go flying down or uh, it could end up real bad for me and the bird. So we don't want that. Uh, oh, we got company up. Oh, it got up pretty easy. Guess it wised up. <laughs> Ouch. So it's torpor is gonna go down, uh, you know, nice and slow. So it's all good. Come on. Ah, I see it. Okay, here we go. There we go. Now we can pump in a few more, and then it'll start running. So we gotta take its fight away from it because then it, it gets much easier but uh, for the meantime my biggest concern is uh, not losing it because uh, these guys are hard to see uh, did it turn? might have turned back <laughs> oh jeez Oh, there you are. All 
right? All right, so it still has fight in it. So, oh crap! <laughs> all right, let's pump a few into it. It's all right. We can handle it. Uh, I think it turned back. I should have felt something. I didn't feel anything. So it. Uh, I, I don't think it has fight left in it. There you are. It's all about the running. <laughs> and you know, I mean, I, I guess I could uh, set up a trap, but right now it's like I just don't really have the time to sit there. And and plus, this bird doesn't doesn't hold very much weight. Yeah, stay right there. You ain't coming after me. Shoot. Yeah, it's always gonna turn around. So when it comes at you and tries to psych you out, just uh stand your ground and uh and but I don't mean do it, you know, at first. I mean you gotta make sure that it's running away from you all the time because uh, you could get in trouble. Oh, this is gonna be this is gonna take a little while. Well, we're still at it, and uh, oh, free meat! Nice. I need a little meat for my pteranodon. We're good now, so it's still running around. It's giving me a hard time, so that's all right. It should be going down soon, and see, it doesn't fight back at all, so I'm just all over it. I just want to give it a big hug. <laughs> Come on. Like, what's it gonna take? I couldn't even tell you how many uh, arrows I've put into it already. And still go. And we got alphas all around us. So, yeah, this is not a good situation. But. I gotta have it. I need it. So there's half over there. Okay, yeah, run that way. That's the way I want you to run. Nope, nope. I'll cut you off on this side. There you go. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> that arrow looked like it was stuck in midair. Ouch, what was that? Alright. I can feel it. You're almost done. There's two alphas over there. And that's exactly where he's running. It's getting a little rough. A little rough. Obviously I won't go down right there. But over here I will. There you go. Okay. Just needed to see how far we were from the alphas. Oh, it's perfect. Come on. Yeah, there you are. I landed right on it. <laughs> Come on. Ah, and there it went. All right, so... <laughs> We're good, guys. We are good. All right. Okay, so, you know, I didn't want you to see all the boring stuff, so I went ahead. Oh, this guy's getting close. Gotta make sure... Uh, Ouch. Come on, buddy. Follow me. Because he could just reach over the spike wall. Actually, he could walk right over the spike walls. But I went ahead and put spike walls. Um, I don't feel good about it. I don't like putting spike walls, but I just didn't have time to build, you know, thatch uh, anything and put it around because there's just too much crap around here. Oh, give me that. Uh, there's too much, you know, danger around here, and uh, that takes a, a lot longer than making a few spike walls. But, uh, eh, as long as this guy follows me this way, yeah, it'll be busy over here. I already put uh, 
the kibble in the saber and it's getting pretty close I mean we have just a few minutes so I just gotta protect it so everything's been good and hopefully I will get uh, all my levels but uh, we will see we will see because you know how this game is it's always full of surprises yeah any minute come on buddy then I gotta figure out how I'm gonna take it back but uh, I'm thinking that I'll probably put it somewhere kinda safe up the mountain maybe and uh, not that mountain screw that talking about the maybe the volcano and uh, come back and pick it up with the uh, quets should probably land to get some stam back but yeah guys we're really close I'm excited because uh, now I can finally go and uh, hit some caves and you know get that going plus uh, we need a, a beetle so that would be a, a good way to good way to end the day is with a beetle but so far the day's been pretty good say we've got a lot of things come on we should have about a minute minute and a half the alphas are still pretty far away I see an Anki and everything's looking good why is that parasaur running like that oh it's a dillo yeah man I, I've, I've always had uh, really bad luck with these uh, spikies but I think today's gonna work out so <laughs> I'm happy about that because usually things go like right under them and uh, like I was uh, taming our dodiki and a dillo actually went right in somehow oh Look at those little doggies running around. Come on, buddy, get up. Get up. But of course, Dillos won't go after the saber, so I'm not worried about that. Oh crap! Oh hell no! <laughs> no 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 no! Are you freaking kidding me? Holy hell! I can't even get in there. God dang it. Oh, yeah, sure. Oh, so now you, they run. Man. <laughs> like, I want to punch something right now, guys. <laughs> Those freaking hyenas. Holy hell. Oh, that sucks. Oh, my God. I lost a lot of levels. That was like, that, I mean, it had literally like 10 seconds left. You gotta be kidding me. And I, and I just got done talking about those darn spike walls. Like, I saw those dogs run right over them, which is ridiculous. Well, I'm about to go on a hyena killing rampage, so until next time, keep surviving. My work saved the human race.